Sagittarius, there is something from the past. Now, what I'm seeing here, if you are an evolved and sage Sagittarius, okay, um, or just much older, you've been there, done that, you know that you need to get off that hamster wheel. You know that this is not going to work out. I've been through this, done that, okay? For others of you, you got lessons to learn again. This is like you are going on the same, same, I like to say, the hamster wheel. Um, this is like just the same pattern. You knew what the last results were. They're just going to, it's going to happen again. And then other people around you that maybe see that aren't going to be exhausted and when and it's telling you don't complain to me later. So, you know, some of you just got lessons to learn and there's nothing we can do. So I do see that kind of energy. So what it does tell me is you need to take another approach this time. You need to balance things. All right, there's a lesson to learn. It's spiritual as well. This is needing to be more independent, maybe. Um, but, you know, I mean, you can do what you want. I am just explaining what I'm saying. Um, there's talks of this could be harmonious and promises and things like that. But I would definitely balance things. Uh these changes you want to make, you have more options and reevaluations. Okay, so balance is going to be important. Moderation is key. I want to say patience. Think things through. Um, being sensible, looking at something very strongly this week. What's the purpose? What's what's the end result? Okay, so finding that meaning is going to be important for some of you. All right, so I'm definitely seeing that kind of energy. Um, these could be some options coming to you. There's actually more resources or help out there. Uh, there is... I want to say even counting your blessings now. Okay. It's like, this is like a same, same old, same old. That's all. A lot of you, this is important to delve into spirituality. Pay attention to the dreams that you've had. Maybe you've forgotten. They were red alerts or something. And then you need to tie up what's going on now. So there is that kind of energy. For some of you, there will be a wish coming through. This is like something you've been wanting. Um, or you think there's no way out in something. But there is a spark of miracle here. Um, it's like, don't confuse atonement with attunement, I want to say. This is like a union coming together in that, but this seems like it's going to bust in the future if it's something that's like um, happening over and over again, okay? So you're being spiritually guided. The sage ones are going to follow up the others. I guess it's lessons to learn, okay? So I do see that kind of energy because there's a lot of hope. Now, there can be, like I said, an offer of something. If something sounds too good to be true, it's too good to be true. For some of you, you're going to shut that down. Nope, I've been there. I've done that. I ain't doing that again. So I like that, okay? I do see you could be turning your back on some people as well or some kind of opportunity. And then you're like, oh, gosh, oh, what am I going to do? There is something else coming, okay? This is not thinking, this is thinking not with your heart or, well, it's a combination. Thinking a lot more logically is going to be very important, okay? So seeing that kind of energy here too. For some of you people are going to be surprised that you've been there, done that, and you know better, okay? <laughs> So, making an important judgment call this week is going to be very, very important because this can alter things for you in the future. There's cause and effect, okay? Rebirth. There's a sense of uh, happy family, happy unions, but is that going to be also short-lived 
this is like someone may be promising you heaven and earth here. Okay, so just be careful of that. 